let's face it, real estate has never been more challenging for the broker owner and team leaders. Uh, inflation with resources costs are through the roof. The market has slowed in different areas. Interest rates have made real estate sales stagnant. So if you are a broker owner and are looking for possibly different options, um, but yet really value your brand that you've built over these years, but want to maybe, I don't know, uh, leverage the, the resources of a different entity, then real brokerage may be something to consider. So if you just have seven and a half minutes to hear from our president, Sharon, I'm going to go ahead and hand that over to him right now to basically break down what may be available for you at Real Brokerage so that you can focus on helping your agents, growing your business, and take off a lot of the hats that have nothing to do with selling real estate directly and do what you do best, get back into your skill set. So without any further ado, here is Sharon. If you are a broker, owner, or team leader in North America, then I made this video just for you. Hey, my name is Sharon Trivatsa. I serve as the president of Real, and I'm an operator just like you. And I want to showcase for you what we have built that could maybe change your business and your life forever. But just a little backstory. I had a chance to build an independent brokerage a few years ago. We had a chance to build it from one office and roughly 30-ish agents to 22 offices and 700 plus agents doing billions of dollars of sales. And we grew it 10x in five years and were acquired by Douglas Elliman. And within 90 days of the acquisition, we completely rebranded the company, the brand that we'd spent so many years building, the brand that we'd spent millions of dollars creating, the brand that we put our love, blood, sweat, and tears into creating and imbuing was gone poof. And we realize this is important because brands are really, really powerful. Brands are, brands are the identity in the local marketplace. Brands allow us to have deep emotional connection to who we are and what we do, which is why I'm super excited to talk about this one program that we built, which we call the private label. We've realized that there are 900,000 plus agents in North America who work with small independents. And these 83,000 plus independents have built a local market brand, emotional connection to their marketplaces, and are so deeply entrenched. And they can never leave those behind, and they never should. Which is why uh, we recently did a pilot, and we have done a private label program, allowing a way in which independent brands can come and partner with Real while keeping their brand, while keeping the brand, while keeping the look and feel, and even legally operating and writing contracts as that brand. The private label component allows independents to join a fast-growing company like Real without losing that which binds them to their true identity in their marketplace. Now, having done this in our private label program, which is now available to all of you, we saw a deeper need. Onboarding multiple independents, uh, talking to dozens of teams who are high producing, we realized that there was a deeper need and the need was to have the flexibility of a model. And what do I mean by that? The flexibility of model is extremely important because one of the things that goes along with the brand is the model. How do we actually take a model and give the flexibility to you, the team leader, to you, the entrepreneur. And most times what most real estate companies will say is in the old school way of talking about this, we'll talk about being agent centric. Now, come on, right? Uh, what else can you be? You have to be agent centric, but it has to be more than that. We believe that it has to be more than that. Not only has it to be agent first, but we believe that it has to be entrepreneur centric, which is you need to be able to take your, the flexibility of your business model and overlay it on top of the platform that we have. That's when magical things happen. Now, let me give you some real examples. When you talk about the business model, you're talking splits, caps, fees that make it good for everybody. For example, let's say you wanted to operate your team on top of the real model with a 75-25 split. Well, how amazing would it be if all of that got immediately reconciled where 
the splits were reconciled, the fees were reconciled, and all the way down to the CDA level with full transparency. Or let's say you had uh, several different economic plans as a broker owner or team leader and the ability for you to configure plan A, plan B, plan C, all from a single dashboard so that you can serve your agents well. Or maybe based on certain new lead gen sources like a Zillow or a Trulio or a homes.com or an op city or a relocation, you had different groups of agents and you wanted to change their economics uh, based on fees and caps paid by you or by them. You can do that all from one configuration screen. And most importantly, if you like the real model and you wanted to bolt a new model on top of it, maybe you had a multi-cap structure to incentivize the agent. Maybe you had a local market leadership where you wanted to incentivize them. You can do all of that from one configuration screen. We realized that the flexibility of the model for you, not just at the agent level, not just at the cap level, not just at the split level, not just at the fee level, not just at the dashboard level, but down to the CDA where there's full transparency and full accounting around it is where the power is. This allows you to have the, the brand as in a private label. This also allows you to utilize your own business model without restrictions bolting onto the real platform. But there's one more missing piece and that missing piece is actually extremely important because just because you have the brand and you have the model doesn't mean you have the ability to scale. Scale is important in today's market because the, both the economic climate and the new regulatory environment allows, needs all of us to bolt onto a rocket ship, bolt onto a platform of possibilities that allows you to do what you do best while we can run the brokerage layer extremely well. Imagine now you have a chance to plug in to scale. You get scale where, where you get it at a level that you could not always build it on your own. Imagine plugging in to the number one fastest going publicly traded real estate brokerage in the world. Imagine on day one automatically getting the tech, the tools, and the plethora of training that is instantly available to you and to your agents. But most importantly, you're bolting on to a culture of performance and a culture of collaboration that has no silos. Because the power of we is greater than the power of me. This allows for deep, deep growth that takes it to a whole new level. This is what we're extremely, extremely proud of. The reason I'm sharing this with you is that if you, are, uh, if you are an independent and you're interested in the private label model, we're excited to share it with you. If you're a broker owner or team leader and you're excited about pro teams and bolting onto real and then having full configura configuration on your business model, we're excited to share that with you. Or you just wanna bolt all of those on to a platform of possibilities, we can't wait to tell you about it. Now, please, please, please know this. There is no hard sell. We wanna make sure that you are aware of these opportunities. The awareness uh, allows you to know that when you don't know your options, you don't really have any. So if you're interested in the private label option, if you're interested in the pro teams option, if you're interested in bolting on to the platform of possibilities to make sure it's good for you, it's good for your team, and it's good for your family, we'd love to talk to you and we'd love to actually open up our entire playbook to you.